Okay, new photo bucket tutorial. So, we've got a photo bucket. Let me see if I can get this a little straighter here. Got this really cool program for my computer that I can uh, record my desktop with, but I don't have a freaking microphone. So, okay. I'm gonna log in. Here is my new retarded homepage. Okay, so now it, the layout's completely different. You got the library button right here, and then you can view your library. And this is where you go to look at all your pictures and stuff. Um, now, for bulk uploading, you either create a new album, which is right here, and then title your album. So we'll create a new album. Give your album a name, we'll call it blah, 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 blah. Okay, and then hit create. I hit cancel because I don't want to create that album. But once you hit create, it'll take you to that album. And then, uh, once you're in that album, it'll give you the option to upload pictures. So let me pick an album here. Let's go with this one. <clears throat> Alright, there's only four pictures here. Okay, so if you want to upload pictures, okay, this little button right here that says more with the check mark next to it, drop down that menu and the very first option right there is upload to album. Click that and then that brings up this window right here, okay? Any files on your computer that you want to upload or pictures, open that folder or you can click here and hit browse files. And that'll bring up your entire hard drive. So pick your picture folder where your or your memory card or whatever the uh, the media is that you have the pictures on, and then you select them all. You can either click them one at a time, holding down the control key, or you can do a drag and drop one at a time. Okay. Now this is where the old bulk bulk uploader it used to allow you to automatically resize these. You could put in predetermined dimensions and it would automatically resize the pictures as you're uploading them can't do that anymore at least not yet so once you do that um, so once you get all your pictures and stuff uploaded then it's going to take you to your library so let me go back to the library and now I'll show you guys uh, multi-linking all right, so we'll go to Bravo. All right, now I've only got four pictures in this, but I mean, I mean, you'll probably have a lot more uh, pictures in this album. Now, for multi-linking, what you have to do, I mean, and you can, when you go into, if you go into your user settings right here, you have to turn on multi-linking. So go to your user settings. Okay, albums. Okay, and then links right here. If the only one I have selected is the image code because that's the only one I ever use that's right here. Um, but you can check all of these boxes and when you go back to an album, that little gear cog with the drop down menu, that'll give you all of those options for each one of these individual code sources. Uh, like I said, I only use the image code because I only post pictures to the forum. So. And then right below that here, You've got this turn on easy linking mode. You need to check that. Okay, and then you need to check this link back option. Okay, so these two bottom boxes right here need to be checked. So we'll save that. All right, now we're going to go back to my library. We're going to view the library. These are all my different albums. Oh, yeah, I'm going to give you feedback later, you dirty bitches, but not right now. Um, alright, so we'll go back to this album again. Alright, now for multi-linking. 
rather than sit here and drop this down and, and copy the link and then paste and then copy and paste, multi-linking is a great tool. So what you want to do is you want to click this blue button right here in the top left that says organize. Okay, now that's going to open up this little bottom menu right down here that you probably can't even see. Right there, okay. Right here, this link button is what you're going to do. So you're going to select this photo, this photo, this photo, and this photo. But you have to hold down the control button to select them all. Okay. Now this link button right here with the little chain link on it, once you click that, this gives you the image codes or whatever codes you have selected in your user settings where we just were before this. So I only have the image codes checked, so this is all I'm going to get is the image codes. So click that one time, it copies it, done. Now if I go to the forum, I can right click and do a paste, and it will paste all of those codes just like it used to into the forum post. So that's uh, multi-linking and bulk uploading. Still don't have a bulk resize yet. Once they do, I'll update this and throw it out there, but for now... This is, uh, this is about as good as it gets unless you want to jump ship like I'm considering. But I'm going to give them some time because they, they lost their contract with the last people who were handling all that stuff, which is why they're making these changes. It's not uh, not so much that they wanted to, but their contract expired and they couldn't re-sign. So. New software, new technique, blah, 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 boring, uh, pain in the ass. So that's multi-linking and that's uh, bulk uploading. And then when you're done here, you just want to exit this organizer, and that takes you back to the regular album. Okay? So, but I'll update this as new features become available to us, and we'll go from there. Hopefully it's not too long. Talk to you later, guys.